Hey, welcome to Pop Drop Disc Golf. Today we have Corey Ellis putting for us. Well, kinda. Let's do it. So, <laughs> yes, we have Corey Ellis putting for us, but not really. We're taking his stats and putting them on a wheel for putting. So, circle two putts, which we have a range finder to decide if we're circle two. We will spin, and if it lands on the circle two make, means you make it. And that's it. If you miss, you spin again, and anything besides this missed putt means you make it. So, he has a 90% circle, uh, circle one putting percentage. Crazy. And he has a 36% circle two, which we're just doing 30 because it's easier on the wheel. <laughs> so, yeah, let's do it. Let's see, let's see who can win without putting. It's all, it's all about throwing inside circle one. So we're playing nine holes. And if we uh, like the concept, we're, we'll do 18 eventually. But yeah, we're starting on this hole. It's out into a field. So it's all about accuracy. Or just go in. Ooh. Well, that's circle one, I think. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> that was that was an ace run right there. <laughs> or just ace it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> ah! Double ace run. Double ace run. <laughs> well, it's gonna be a good day, I guess. <laughs> so I am well within circle one. Pretty much a tap in. Peter is, it's close. 32 feet. I am inside circle. Wow, one. it's the elevation. <laughs> yeah. Plays a trick on your mind, he's inside. Inside, just barely. So we both get to spin. Okay, I'll, I'll spin first, cause I'm, well, actually you spin first. You're okay. further away. I'm further out. Anything but that blue mist putt. No, no, oh, okay. And he's got We're a birdie. Good. It's a birdie. <laughs> it's a birdie. <laughs> And I spin. It would suck to miss my tap in pretty much. Right. Ah! Oh! Well, that's unfortunate. All right. So uh, that was a nice birdie. I got lucky. Hit the putt. Next hole, we're going down uh, down into the protected green. Nice straight shot. Open chains. Here we go. There's a hyzer gap. Oh. That's well outside circle I, two. Yeah, I don't even know if I'm gonna be in circle two with that one, dang. Oh! Well, that's another circle one. Corey, don't let me down. <laughs> Please. 52. Yeah! I mean, if you make this, Corey's a wizard, because there is not a line. Look at this line. There Look at this line. line. Disc. No line. Oh. Miss putt. He's not a <laughs> wizard. And Corey, don't do me dirty again. Uh, we're good. Nice I putt. made a birdie. Good putt. Let's go. Okay, <laughs> Peter's got to make his par. I've got to do the par. And he's in. Yeah, he's we're in. good. Par. Needed that one earlier there, Corey. <laughs> <laughs> so I took the box back. So next hole is through the grove that we just played pretty much. You can go big hyzer or you can go forehand down the gap, which is what I'm doing. That is well outside circle too. Just a little inside. I missed my cloud breaker two every day. Fall is not kind to yellow discs. I'm also going forehand gap. Without the leaves, that doesn't look as terrifying, so. <laughs> Boo. Oh. Well, that might, might be in circle one. Might be in circle one. It'll be edge, but it'll be circle. <laughs> Oh, 
well. Wow. That's a tap in. Man, it sucks 90% on tap ins. Come on. I'm nervous. I, I missed a 10 footer. Inside well, inside circle one for my bogey putt. Don't do me wrong, Corey. We're good. We're good. Good. It's a putt. Bogey. If he misses uh, this, I'm. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Ellis, not Adam Hammond, right? <laughs> yeah, we're playing with Corey Ellis. Oh no. Ooh. He almost chained out on a tapping. So next hole, it's down, and you kind of wrap it around this tree. Turn over or forehand. Dang, that was earlier than I thought it would be. It's a good toss though. That's fine. Be circle two. I'll be spinning, but if I'm looking for one of these C2 makes, that's what I need. C2 make That'd coming huge. in. Huge. Hit this birdie putt. Quiet on the green, please. Thank you. Oh. Ah. Just missed. Chained out. I might be circle two. We can range. I it. think I am. Circle two. That sucks. That is unfortunate. Please. Dang it. And I think we're going to do two circle one at the same time because it will make it faster. So yeah. Peter would have made it because he didn't land on miss putt during his circle two putt. And I made it because I didn't land on miss putt for my circle two putt. Does that make sense? I think it makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. So next hole. So we're on in for pars. Pars. So if you like having all of these uh, guest appearances here, Go ahead and like and comment, subscribe. You know, like and subscribe, and we'll just have some fun here with Corey. And you know, maybe we'll get Nate Sexton out here. You never know, but Ricky Wysocki, all of them. Corey's kind of letting us down a little bit. Can't make a circle two putt. And misses some tap-ins, so, you know. Uh, next hole is down between those two trees. Just get it around those trees and you're good. Hit the tree. That was so high, way too high. That was way too high and not wide enough. Woo, I think that's gonna be circle one. This is barely outside circle two at 70. So maybe my 0.8% chance of making this will, will make it go in as I throw it into the ground off a putt. I put this pretty close for Corey, so hopefully he can just tap this in for me real quick one time. 90%, you know. 90%. He, he, he should be able to. From right here, this distance. Got that, it. That's, that's, that's a, a bird. That's a make. Man, you better. Jeez, he's... He's trying, he's, he's tanking for you. Like he's trying to make me lose. Right. He's trying to miss those putts. That's what it feels like. Right. Corey, put that in, put that bird in for me. So we're tied at one down. Next hole, up, and up the hill. Miss the trees on the left, miss the trees on the right. Sit. That's that gonna was be, a big skip. Yep. That was right at the basket and then huge skip. Oh, that was looking so good. That was and then so the, pretty. Oh, those tree limbs things. Darn fingers. Look at those grabbers. I don't even get Corey yet. Nope. You're supposed to let Corey do all the putting, and I'm, I'm having to like putt outside circle too. Good run. That's a good run. Yeah. Man. Yeah. Trusting Corey for a 10 footer. 28 feet. Yeah, that feels more like yeah. 28 feet. Feels like Dang. 28. Oh, that's not good for me. And hit the pot. Yeah, we got it. Another bird. Corey, you're doing me right tonight. Well, will Corey miss the, the tap in for me? I do want to look. Oh, it's blue. No, we're good. 
We're good. <laughs> We're good. Good par. I'm down one now. Thanks. My, my, how the tables have turned. Here we go. Next hole. Down into the open field. Uh, the forehand line has a tree in the way. The backhand is pretty open. Well, that's that's deceivingly short. I think it's going to be just outside circle edge. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah. It needed to be wider, but it hopefully good. we're inside circle one. Yeah, we're good. Or Corey makes a big putt if we're out. 31. We're good. 31. That's close. What's funny is I feel more, I feel like more confident in myself than the wheel, and it's 90%. I, I that's I, I don't know why that is, and maybe it's because it's failed me once already. But I'm good. We're good. Birdie. Now for me, I'm over there. Oh no, is it good? It did it to him! Dang it. He got the fate. He got the Missed same Missed the pot. Out. Dang it. That's okay. That ties it up. Corey coming in clutch for me. Not so clutch for Peter. <laughs> Next hole. We got two holes left. Next hole is just straight between those two trees across the little road. Dip. Dip. Skip. It skipped. Which is what I wanted. I just threw it a lot lower at the beginning than I wanted, but hey, it worked. Oh, that branch hurt you. That's good, though. That's really good. That branch kept you straight. It, it kept it straight just a little too long, but. Yeah, you're It also didn't make it turn over, which is what I was happy about. <laughs> I was afraid it was going to flip it even more and put it in the road. <laughs> yep. 50. So, circle two. Oh, Corey, please. Oh, that last one stopped. I know. I was like, you don't want that. That would be bad. So, at least I made the circle one putt. I'm in for par, but not. Didn't get the circle two. 23. Oh. Pretty close. Pretty close. All right, Corey, do me right here. If you get this, that means I need this last hole. We got it. Yeah, made birdie. All right, here we are, last hole of the challenge, up behind the porta potty. Hopefully, we don't have any crappy drives. That would suck. That's going in the sand. That is not close. We're in the sand. Blech. That's Ooh. that's close. Yeah, it's pretty sandy out here. Um, I'm gonna honestly just try and take this into my own hands. Are you I'm trying well to make outside, it? I'm well outside circle two. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna go for it. Why not? That's perfect for the three. Yeah. If Corey cooperates. 34. 34. 34 feet. Yeah, 34 feet. That's Just. as close as I could get. Just barely. Here we go. Got a 30% chance at taking the win. It's not a good percentage. I mean, this is the tie, not the win. Oh, that's true. This is the tie. Oh, it didn't click. Come on, Corey. It's not. It's not that hard, man. See, it's 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 not that hard. That went in. You hear change, man. I mean, you still got to make yours because I did That's make true. my. So I do. I'm in for three. In for par. So he needs to spin for his tap in. It's a ten percent chance 90, that we're tied. Ninety percent chance. If you like this video. Comment down below, should we try it again? Should we play 18? Who should we have for a putt for us next? Because the winner is... Whoa! <laughs> Me! Oh boy, thank you, Corey. I'm gonna give you a big hug. We'll see you next time, everybody. Have fun, go play some disc golf.